Hey man, welcome back to the 85 South Show. We are live here at the 2024 BET Awards. Come on now. BET Experience. Come on now. BET, BET, <laughs> Black Entertainment Television. And as comedians, we got to talk to some comedians. And we only talking to the top tier comedians. Sure. Some of the best in the game. I'm talking about the Elite Unit Sniper SEAL Team. Uh, Green berets of comedy, <laughs> <laughs> but this dude's so talented with the with the comedy berets. He's really just an entertainer at this point yeah, because sure. it goes far beyond comedy. None other than the world renowned Afion Crockett is Come here on, with man. us today, man. Carlos, Nav, thank y'all, man. Yeah, 85 we, South, the, the biggest brand in the game right now. Talk your shit. <laughs> I'm talking your shit. Okay, that's what I'm mean. <laughs> Listen, when I tell y'all I'm proud, like, because I saw it. I saw it. I saw when y'all started this joint. Yeah. And y'all was at Chuckles doing live shows in, in Memphis and then just grew this whole brand to arena level. Yes, sir. As somebody that's been in the game since 94, you don't see that. You know what I mean? Yeah. Shout out to the Kings of Comedy because they, they found a lane back then to do it. And of course, Kevin Hart. And, you know, we have some examples. But what y'all have done without using material, freestyle comedy at its finest in arenas, mm. bruh, y'all changed the game. I'm inspired. Thank you, brother. I'm inspired. Thank you, brother. That, that means a lot coming from you, man. Thank you, brother. Hell yeah. How you been? I've been I've been well I've been better yeah 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 I've been better man you know we go through ups and downs man I think as entertainers we we try to be too cool all the time and right everything is is flashy and everything is about what's what's popping and with the, the red carpets yeah. and all that type of stuff but nah man you know we we talk a lot about mental health these days but I it ain't it ain't new to me like mm -hmm. I'm always monitoring my mental health and just making sure I'm good reset yeah. yeah. but you said you've been in since 94, like, you know what I'm saying? You said it, like, but the beats are relevant still at this point. Like, well, mm. like. When he said that, I was like, I got too much gray. I got too much. <laughs> Bruh, doing too and much. And you're staying young. Like, what that's the hell what you fuck I'm saying? <laughs> this motherfucker got vampire blood. <laughs> Asian like, every what birth. What nigga doing? Yeah, nigga. <laughs> nigga. Uh, you know, positive thinking, man. <laughs> I'm going to be real with you. Positive thinking take you a long way. And it, right. it stays off your face. Yeah. The mm. age stays off your face if you take negativity out your fucking life. Mm. And that's negative people, and that's negative disposition in your mind. Take that shit and throw it away. Absolutely. You know what Makes I mean? Sense. Absolutely. Stress that that might be the hardest shit that's been said this whole weekend. <laughs> what? Negative thinking. Negative people. Yeah. Even if you don't engage, just being around a negative mother. Baby mama negative. is cut off. <laughs> Bro, you know when it comes to baby mamas, the only quote that stands out to me is by somebody I don't even fuck with. Who? George W. Bush. What'd he say? What'd he say? We do not negotiate with Terry. <laughs> <laughs> this is a fact. That's the best thing that nigga said that's ever. The, that's the hardest quote of, right. the, of the century from, yeah. from old right. W. And they are definitely terrorists. Man, come on. Yeah, I've lived with a couple terrorists. <laughs> Energy vampires. What? <laughs> Suck your soul. Now that might That's a whole nother show That's a whole My bad I no, That was my fault That's a whole nah, nother show good, yeah. you know what Hey I mean? man what you looking forward to this weekend Anybody you looking forward to seeing perform or? I'm be honest I mean outside of Will Smith performing You know cause he don't get enough credit for his music I think That nigga's the Listen he came from hip hop For sure And became the box office king oh. For 20 years we don't talk about Will Smith enough. We don't put enough respect on his name. But he's performing tomorrow on, on the music tip. But Bad Boys for Life just dropped. And him and Martin already a billion dollars worldwide. Right. Like, when, stop stop playing with his name. When he in movies, I call him Will Smith. Yeah. When he rapping, he the Fresh Prince. That's valid. I thought I was just biased by doing that. Yeah. Nah, that's valid. That's I mean, that's and what And you it fucked is. me up because I didn't even know he was performing. I thought oh, that yeah. was just a rumor. No, 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 no. He's, I mean, he's been posting it on his, on his page. Like he's rehearsing with uh, Sunday Service. Yeah, they. Oh, that's he dope. Got a new song out with them, and uh, I'm looking forward to that. But I, I'm, this ain't no cap. Like I'm, I'm happy to be here with y'all. Word. Like all this other stuff is great, and and I'm talking to people, and that's great. But I told my folks, I said 85 South. That's who I want to sit down with. Man. So that's that's what I Man. was looking forward to. And now that I've seen y'all, 
I'm only looking forward to what <laughs> That's what's up, man. Man, you back out on the road or what? What's up? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll be in Raleigh next month, Chicago. Uh, I'm out here cooking, man. And I don't know if y'all seen uh, a hip hop story, my movie. Oh, nigga, you did I your motherfucking thing. I haven't though. seen it, man. Hey, what's yeah. the, bur- the best impersonation you think you done ever did? A hip hop story. Because I. I played 13, yeah. 14 people in the movie. But that's what I was saying. Out of out of those. Oh, out of yeah, those? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to go Cornell West because that was the biggest reaction in the movie. Yeah. The, the people was bent over laughing at that shit. And uh, it's at a hiphopstory.com now. I went right to the people. Um, but you got to check it out. I will. You, I just you would been, be proud of me. I just been tied up. No, he, and then I was doing College Hill. I was gone for oh, a yeah, little bit. Oh, yeah, yeah. I've been seeing, I've been seeing the clips. The road, so. I've been seeing the clips. You was being real Carlos on there. Yeah, absolutely. I love it. Absolutely. <laughs> I said, that's my <laughs> nigga right Bruh, there. I wanted to always ask you, like, what's your process when you're developing your characters? Because like you said, you do so many. It's like, are mm-hmm. you one of those people who can just see it and, and it's locked in? Or you do extensive research and watch a bunch of hours of footage or what? No, for most of them, I could just kind of see it. Mm. Mm. I've been observing since see, I was a See, that's crazy. Kid. Yeah. I've been, mm. I just been observing since I was a kid. Like, I'm one of those people that don't say much. Right. Um, I, I just watch and I see you you are like that too. I'll watch motherfuckers and just see what their nuances are. I when I do impressions, I be seeing people's soul for some reason. Oh. It ain't just about their mannerisms or how they sound. I see their soul. So when I portray them, I don't try to portray them in a funny way. I just try to do it like an actor would. Oh. I'm an actor. Oh. I just but portray see, the a, reality. The comedy just a, natural. The like reality, yeah, come, the, yeah. The comedy comes from the reality. See, that's what makes, that's what really brings the shit to life, though, is like, not only do you do the voice, you get the mannerisms and, and even the little, the little touches that you add, the comedic touches that you add, don't, it's like, it still fits what you're doing. So big salute. Yeah. Thank you, my brother. To that, bro. Thank you. It yes, ain't indeed. a whole lot of us that really get. I still think that Russell that Simmons shit. still my. That's the one. Yeah, that's the one. <laughs> that's the one. I, I know you said. Well, that's the one that leads take, the movie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly. But it's just. Actual yoga yeah. In tidy whiteies. <laughs> my <laughs> favorite. My favorite one though. The one that makes me laugh all the time. Fucking Maya Angelou. Oh nigga. Yeah. Haiti fine. Haiti fine. <laughs> 85. <laughs> Doesn't matter which way you go on 85. <laughs> 85 North. But of course, 85 South. That shit is crazy, man. Is where everyone needs to go. Oh. 85. Oh, 85. Oh, I wish we, I they wish ask we, how old am I? I say 85. Oh. 85. <laughs> Man, I wish we had some Harriet Tubman footage so you could do that too. <laughs> Shit! Nav, me. Nav. One of the funniest comedians of all time. Oh. If you don't know his name, you better know it now. Before you can't afford him. Oh. Carlos Miller. Carlos Miller. Thank okay. you, Mike. That's right. <laughs> B.E.T. <laughs> Beautifully black. <laughs> About time. Hey, hey, well, was she singing any sexy red songs or no? Huh? Was she singing any sexy red? <laughs> 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 My booty hole. <laughs> I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't do that to Auntie Maya. I can't do it. There's another dude. There's another dude on the gram that be doing that shit with the lyrics. That ain't me. Oh, I ain't never but, seen him do that. Oh, I ain't man. never seen him do yeah, that. Yeah, he be doing it, but I can't take this shit. Oh, man. boy. <laughs> boy. Uh, Damn. Boy. <laughs> he just I, fucked me up, though. Fucked me up, man. All the way. All the way. Uh, 85. Hey, Y'all man. gonna be hearing that shit in your heads. Uh, it, it's stuck later. in there. Polo. 80, 85. What's happening, man? Oh, that's a legend right there. You ain't nah, man. Legendary. <laughs> What's up with you, bro? What's going on, OG? Yes, sir. Cool. We got to get you over here on some Atlanta right. shit. Most definitely, bro. Man. One of the greatest producers of all time Come right now. Come on, bro. For he sure. made throw some Ds. What? He made that. I know. Throw some Ds on it. <laughs> hey, man. It's a line in that song that needs to be in the Library of Congress. Talk to me. I never slip. I never fall. A lot of hoes give me their number and I never call. And that's all. <laughs> Every freak should have a picture of my dick on they wall. Yeah. What? That is. You 
Sometimes you go over a freak house and be like, man, what's that? Oh, that's a polo. That's a that's bitch, like, uh, <laughs> <laughs> That's real, Aeon Dick. Real free. <laughs> he got a platinum dick and diamond balls, bitch. Don't mind that. Just lay down. Yeah, just lay down. <laughs> you being too nosy. Don't, don't worry about Aeon Dick. <laughs> he earned that spot. <laughs> hey, where can they go and find the tour dates and all that, man? Oh, just go to my page uh, on Instagram at Aeon Crockett and uh, go to a hiphopstory.com and download sure. that joint. Hell rent yeah. it, purchase it. Um, it's a vibe, man. And shout out also uh, Microphone Masters. It's another stand-up series I created with Xfinity. And uh, I'm my dog, showcasing. My dog, B. Lewis was on there. B. Lewis, Brandon yeah, yeah. Brandon Lewis, Lewis Ryan G, Kanisha Buss. Um, yeah, Atheon Cracker presents Microphone Masters. So I'm out here cooking, man. I'm just yeah, trying to stay. Yeah, that was dope of you too, man. Trying to stay relevant, man. Hey, man, as always, much love to love, you. Love, bro. You already Anything know. Anything you got going on, we got to get you back on the show, man. Yeah, I got to come down to, to the A and get on that couch, man, and just rock with y'all. Come on, you got to give us another dance fight story, too, <laughs> man. <laughs> that shit was that classic. That shit was crazy. Yeah, and, and real. It was very real. Absolutely. Yeah. Now, that's the next move. We might have to do that one. No, nah, I'm, I'm about I to I want to be you. one of the niggas in the crew. No, no, I'm about to talk uh, about producing a movie for y'all. All right, bet. Yeah. Say less. I'm the missing link. There it is right there. Shit, what else do we have to say? 85 South Show, we live here at the BET Awards 2024. Standing on culture. Come on, man. My what man, Atheon Crockett. We out of here. <laughs>